Hello research scholars, in the last video we have been just seeing how to select a good journals inside the quotes, good journals. So you can just find that video in the uh, description, I am just attaching it. In this video we are going to see how to write the keywords for our respective paper. So if you are finding difficulties, how to choose the uh, keywords or what all the things you need to just include, this video is for you guys. See, consider if your research work is on finding the disease on a leaf. So, considering it as an apple leaf. So, how to write a keyword here? So, abstract you will be writing. So, keyword is a one which is going to give you a citations or people will search based on the keywords. So, if your paper is ranked at the first thing, many people will be just seeing your paper and it will be cited by the other authors and uh, your paper will be just recognizable by the people. So how to make it feasible? See consider how to write a keywords. So I have been just jumbled in the uh, very first uh, thing. So I have been just written uh, simple uh, applications like apple leaf disease, deep learning, method 1, method 2, name method 3, agricultural applications. So this was like whenever your project have been coming into a picture. So you will be getting the methods and these are the rough keywords what we you are going to just push in. So you can just first try what are the keywords which have been feasible for searching your paper. First writing a every keywords. Next thing is to assign how to assign the respective keywords. The first keyword should be broader one. So if the project is on leaf diseases, the broader thing is agricultural applications. The first keyword should be agricultural application. After first keyword, you need to go on narrowing for your respective work. So in an agricultural application, you are concentrating on apple leaf disease detection or apple leaf disease. So in this apple leaf detection, what methods you have been used? Method 1, method 2 and so on. You can go on adding the keywords. See consider if you have been used the VGG16, you cannot add at a method 1. It is an narrowed version. So it has been characterized in a subset of deep learning. So method 1, in the place of method 1, you need to place deep learning. So first one is agricultural application. Second one is apple leaf. In a, in a position of method 1, you need to write deep learning. In a method 2 position, CNN and later on VGG16. So I would just suggest you to have at least 5 keywords which will be useful for you to get the authors to read for your respective paper. So this is what I need to just share with you. First one should be broader agriculture application. In, in agriculture what you are concentrating is apple leaf. How you are going to detect it by using deep learning. Deep learning methods. Or like you are detecting by using VGG16. So VGC16 is a subset of CNN and it is going to be characterized under coming into a picture of under deep learning. So this is a way uh, like how to write how to write uh, a keywords like after Apple you need to go for deep learning later CNN later VGG16. So this is a method what you are going to need to be just followed to find uh, it's like you need to be followed to write the keywords for your papers. So this will in turn help you to attract the more number of authors to read your paper which is going to enhance your citation. So keeping that all this aside but this is a procedure you need to be followed in order to write a keywords. So this is like a standard thing, broader to narrow version. So that's it for this video guys, uh, for a quick summary. So if you are writing any keywords, maintain 5 to 6 
keywords minimum of five to six or four to five keywords so start with a broader one and go towards a narrow thing so that's it for this video guys uh, thank you for watching uh, like subscribe share this video to the research scholars or to your colleagues thank you